Beyond Digital, David here. Today I'm gonna to be unboxing and reviewing some replacement auto feed spools for some Black & Decker electric weed whackers. I personally have the LST201 model that this is advertised to work with. I bought it on Amazon. We can see on the back, they have a bunch of different options right here. GH400, GH500, GH600, LST220, LST300, LST400, LST420, LST136. There's so many options. Be sure to go in the link below. It'll take you right to Amazon. You can see if yours is compatible with this. Now let's go ahead. We'll look at the package right here. So it's really nice. And again, it's just the back showing you everyone that it's compatible with. Has a barcode on the side. Now let's open it up and see what we get. Here are all the package contents. We get six spools, you guys. And then we get a nice spring in the cap cover as well. So that's really a killer deal. Really excited to try this out. Now let's get the weed whacker up here and install one. So got the old cap off right here. Looks really similar in the design. Then you can see where the spring's gonna go. Honestly, I'm probably gonna save the new cap and just set that aside and reuse the old one if I can. Then we got the spool we need to take out right here and put the new one in. Here's the old spool I just took off versus the new spool. They look really similar. You can even see the old one has the Black & Decker logo on it. The new one does not, but that's okay. I didn't want to buy Black & Decker brand anyways. I was trying to save some money. I can already tell this is going to be good enough. So it really looks super similar. So now let me go ahead and show you the back side as well. For each of them, they seem to appear to be the right size, width-wise, whatever you want to call that. It's radius, circumference, and all that seem to appear to match and same with the height or the width as well. So now let's go ahead and put the new one on. Now you can see I put the new spool on and fed it through, make sure the arrows go in the right direction. And now you're ready to put the cap on. Just for this video, I'm gonna put the new cap on just to make sure everything works as it should. The new cap fits great in there as well. So you can either use the new cap or you can go continue to use the old cap, which is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to save this new cap for a rainy day or when I go through a couple more of these spools and throw this one out. I just got back from outside. Everything worked great. My weed whacker, really happy with the results. If you're interested in this product, the link to it is in my video description below. Hit that like button for me, subscribe to my channel, follow me on social media as well, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can message me on WeChat. Check out my website, join my newsletter. Also, don't hesitate to reach out with any questions, comments, or concerns. I'd be happy to answer them for you or point you in the right direction. And I can't wait to see you all in my next video. Thanks.